Wow. A married Texas car dealership heir was found guilty of a sinister murder for hire plot to kill a sex worker and her boyfriend after they attempted to blackmail him, according to authorities. The married man allegedly hired a retired Israeli Defense Force soldier and two retired U.S. Marines to kill the blackmailers. Eric Charles Mond, M-A-U-N-D, 48, was found guilty of conspiracy to commit murder for hire following an 11-day trial. The jury cleared Mound of kidnapping-related charges. Mound and Hare and Air to a lucrative car dealership in Austin reportedly paid $750,000 to two ex-Marines and a former Israel Defense Forces soldier to kill Holly Williams and her boyfriend, William Landway, in 2020. Williams, 33, Landway, 36, were both found in an Acura that had veered off a road, plummeted down an embankment and into a tree in Nashville, Tennessee. The car was found at a construction site and both victims had gunshot wounds in their heads, according to investigators. <coughs> Mound allegedly had an extramarital affair with Williams, who was a sex worker. Mound reportedly received anonymous texts threatening to expose his affair with Williams unless he paid $25,000. The blackmail texts were purportedly sent by Landway in March of 2020. In response, Mound hired retired IDF soldier Galad Pallet to find out who was blackmailing him and paid him $60,000. He told me that he went to visit his son in Nashville, Tennessee, where he goes to college, and while he was there, he was using escort services. Pallet testified in court. When he came back, he got a text message, a text message that was demanding money, and if he would not pay them, they would contact his family and out the fact that he was using escort services, Pallet added. Pallet allegedly advised Mound to inform law enforcement about the blackmail scheme. Pallet said he was reluctant to go to the police. He didn't want information to come out says it's going to hurt his marriage. He didn't want his kids to know about it. He said it's going to devastate him if his kids are going to find out. Pleb recruited former Marines, Brian Brockway and Adam Carey, to go to Nashville and conduct surveillance on Williams and Landway. However, the group did not make any contact with their targets after 10 days, according to Pleb. Landway then reportedly called Mound's home, which freaked out the car dealership heir. Landway allegedly demanded Mound pay him $25,000 by 8 p.m. on March 11, 2020. Brockway reportedly proposed to take Mr. Landway out, which Mound allegedly jumped on the offer. According to court documents, Mound paid $100,000 each to Brockway and Kerry plus $550,000 to Pallet. Damn. Pallet testified that Broadway instructed him to get rid of your phone, which he understood that he had killed Landway. Broadway fatally shot Landway in the parking lot of Williams' apartment complex and Carrie murdered Williams after driving to the construction site. On November 17th, Carrie and Broadway were each convicted of conspiracy to commit murder for hire, kidnapping resulting in death, and conspiracy to commit kidnapping. They both face a mandatory life in prison or the death penalty when they are sentenced in 2024. We are committed to aggressively prosecuting violent crime in Middle Tennessee, and I am very pleased that the men responsible for these murders have finally been held accountable for their deplorable actions. U.S. Attorney... Henry Levinas declared in a statement. Damn. These motherfuckers. Crazy. $750,000. That's a lot of money. Sadly, they'll never get to spend a dime of that shit. <laughs>